off we pop then. Uh, evens or odds or high roll? What's your what's your what's your flavor? Uh, evens or odds? Let's do it. Call it uh, odds. Evens always goes that All right, way. We'll take the play. Okay. Oh, I called your deck Grixis Tempo. Is that fair? What do you I, want to call it? I think. What yeah. would you call it? Grixis Tempo. Grixis like Delver. Like Delve. Delve Kess. <laughs> yeah, Delve Kess. <sighs> okay. Um, I have the life totals up there. Is that clear enough for you? Do you want them somewhere else? That's fine by me. Cool. Yeah. Look up. Cool, cool, cool. Um, and the other thing is we'll just show our hands. Yeah. To the, the table, we'll and uh, you don't have to talk through or anything, but we'll just you know, show them off. So. Okay. Best of luck. No, yeah, same. You can cut if you want. No. Just because I'm not doing it, I feel like you don't have to do it. I don't want to peer pressure you, Scooty. You're, you're good. You're good. I'm getting there. Gotta do my best. Yeah, don't look. Okay. Um, I'm going to have to throw it back, so do you want me to show it first? Or um, do I even need to... Don't worry about it. All right. Uh, you can just throw it back. Yeah. They don't have to know what you mulliganed. It's fine. They just got to follow the game as it goes. I think I got to mulligan this, too. Okay. It's really rough. Yeah. It's so close, but I don't think it gets there. Yeah. Because you kill my Arbor Elf. It's just like lights yeah. out. And, and the I only... think you have quite a few ways to kill my Arbor Elf, if memory serves. One or two. One or two. I should really... I've like take take because I went through and like made a big video talking about everyone's deck and how I thought the matchups were, but mm -hmm. I didn't take notes. And now I'm like, it's hard to keep yours and Evans and Steve's deck straight in my head. Yeah, like, like I know which one's which, but I can't remember like one of them. I know is lacking a lot of small ball removal, but has a lot of good hard removal. Uh, I think that's Evans' deck. Yeah, that's not mine. I, I can think, tell you. That. I think Evans' deck has like good hard removal, but not a lot of like cheap small ball stuff. Uh, I think your deck is chock full of it, and my Arbor Elf would be likely toasted. Yeah, depending on how my mana unfolds early on, I'll have some interaction, um, but hopefully my cantrips will draw me into it if I don't have it right off the bat. And this is much better. All right, don't show it off. Let me show my hand first, because yeah. I'm, I'm on the play. I'll be looking over here. All right, uh, I'm going to keep this hand... Uh, no peeking. No peeking. Chat. I feel bad, but I think I got to bottom this. Well, on the other hand, yeah, I can bottom this, and if I get, I can get there if I need to. But that's more flexible. All right. I'll show your hand if you don't mind. Yep. Okay. So here's where we're at. We're on Mulligan down to six. Um, very much a fan of these three. Um, this all will work together, and then I think the way this is going to work out. You can talk to it if you want, but you don't have this, to. This, to will, uh, this will go on the bottom, and then we'll uh, take it from there. Hopefully, it'll come together. All right. Read a ball. Let's do it. I'll go to 17, get a stomping ground, okay. and play an Arbor Elf. There it is. <clears throat> and I will pass the turn. Okay. I will tap upkeep draw. I'm going to bolt the bird, I guess. I'm just going to lead right off with an unholy heat on the Arbor Elf. Sure. You got it. Pass the turn. All right. I'll untap. I will draw. Den of the Bugbear. Mm -hmm. Ren and six. Ren and six. Don't love that for me. Uptick on Wooded Foothills. Yeah. And pass. Okay, this is these are magic cards. I'm gonna shock in a steam vents. I've got you at 18. Thank you. I'm gonna tap that mountain. Go with the DRC. You got a dragon's rage channeler. And then I'm gonna follow it up with a faithless looting trigger. Trigger surveil. Get it going. Um, I'm gonna bin. The scalding turn. Sure. Draw two. <sighs> okay. These are magic cards. An island and a steam vents. Sure. Um, three for delirium. Pass the turn. I'll untap. I will draw. 
Uh, Steve has mutagenic growth, not you, right? I do not have mutagenic okay. growth. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I will downtick on yep. the Dragon's Rage Channeler. R.I.P. I will... I guess I should actually play this land first. I'll play a Wooded Foothills. Okay. I'm going to sacrifice it and go and get a... No, I really should get a... Life is a resource. I'm going to go to 14. Yeah. And I will get a... Temple Garden. Okay. And then I'm going to Wild Growth my Stomping Ground. Yeah, seems good. And then I'm going to play an Augur of Autumn. Yeah, that's a... These are cards. And I will pass the turn. Okay. Draw. That could help. Fourteen, eighteen. Scalding Tarn, Crack, and Shock. shock. Yep. Got you a fifteen. We're gonna get a watery grave. And then from here. Start delving. One, two, three, four, five. For a Merktide Regent. I was hoping it'd be Treasure Cruise, I'll be honest. Yeah, I, I wouldn't have minded, but this will this will be a good start. Okay. Um yeah. I'm gonna pass the turn. Yeah, that's basically the card in this matchup I'm worried about, to be honest. Yeah, pack one, pick one. Or, yeah, I guess just round one, pick one. Uh, I will uptick targeting this Wooded Foothills. Yep. It's a really good engine. Play this Wooded Foothills. Dahlia. He and Kieran Nalar. Cool. You got some flyers. It's going to buy me a little time, but not a huge amount of it. Pass the turn. Okay. Island? Mm-hmm. Consider. Mm hmm Definitely be taking that. Um, fork bolt. I assume targeting Thopter Thopter? Yep. You got it. Perfect answer. Yep. Better to be lucky than good. And then I will hit the Ren. You got it. One, two, three, four. Okay. Pass. Um... I will sacrifice this on end step. Okay. Going to 13. All right. Let's get a tapped overgrown tomb. Okay. Untap. Draw. Good combat. Yeah. In for four. I'll take four. Got you at 11. Mm -hmm. Oof. Titania. Right, if you're counter magic sweet, do you mind? Uh, I have force of will in the main deck. Right. I'll play Titania. You got a Titania. I'll get back wooded foothills. Yeah. You got a, you got a game, folks. And... No board wipes. I think you have a deluge in the sideboard, or is that Evan? That's Evan also. That's Evan again? Yeah, my lunch got eight in this the is, draft. This is, this is the problem. I think... 
it is correct to do this. I know it's on top of my library. Well, I want to do it. Yeah. I'm going to do it. I'm going to sacrifice this, get an elemental. Yeah. I'm going to go get a forest. Go to 12. Okay. And I'm going to play Elvish Reclaimer. How many lands in the yard? Just one? Just one. Okay. And I will pass the turn. All right. This is getting a little out of hand for me. Unless I draw what I'm hoping for. Which I did. Um, I'm going to Vendetta, Titania. Cool. Take three, right? It's toughness. Yeah. Toughness. So I'm at eight. Oop. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Treasure cruise. Trigger Merc tied three times. Very nice. Is it each just, just three? Each instant or sorcery. Oh right, right, right. Yeah, yeah. yeah sorry. I, I yeah, yeah, had yeah, to yeah. one of those cards that and it's not one or more, it's every time you exile any land. Yep, 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 yep. Am I off the screen a little bit? That doesn't screen. matter. You're fine. You're fine. Rather give good content as a... Let me just get my cyborg over here ready. <laughs> One, two, three. Okay. Um, I have to pass. Yeah, that's what I was hoping. All right, I will untap draw <clears throat> let's play a let me think for a sec do I just lose hmm? do I just lose here I think so. Why would you just lose? I mean, it's close. Animate den. Yeah, and that's eight. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, that is eight. You're right. It's nine actually, because of the goblin token too. Damn. Yeah, I'll do that. All right. All right. Game two. Let's do it. Whew. <sighs> Did the thing. I'm at least like I was talking about your deck in the thing. I was like, I'm hugely afraid of Murktai region. I have very few answers to it. I was like, my only hope to an early Murktai region is to put enough pressure on yeah. that I can just race it on the ground. Yeah, I mean, you you hit every possible every possible thing at the right time, it felt like. This feels and good against here. you. This also feels good here. This comes out. Don't worry about showing your sideboard. Yeah. Keep people, whatever. They can see the sideboard cards if we draw them. That's how okay. it's going to work. Okay. All right. On the play? Yeah. This deck was really hard to build because... You got a lot of options. I know. It's like the Bedlam Reveler, Murktide Tension. I think my biggest error in my main deck was not putting Brazen Borrower in from the beginning. Borrower was a great card. I like It was uh, Zach was saying he doesn't like it in control decks. I love Brazen Borrower in control decks. I'll, yeah, any I'll put flash it in there anytime. It's going to be good. I mean, yeah, flash threats are fantastic in control and also just like, I don't know, I really like the utility of it. I'll play it in any blue deck. Yeah. I don't think the interaction of Murktai region plus other Dell spells has come up that often in my cube, but it's terrifying. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> if my deck, like my draws were really good for the, the, the way the game unfolded, but there are ways where, especially like the reason why I prioritized faithless looting so early in the draft is I'm just like, I'm turning this out. I it mean, it helps to get your turbo. Yeah. Dell threats. Faithless looting is a good card. Yeah. The, uh, my matches that I've played so far, Tasker has been out on turn two most games yep. which has been great all right i'm sorry i'm taking too long take your time we're in no rush down at... this 
this feels too clunky here. This definitely feels too clunky. Like this, it's only four arrows poured out. This, 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 I just don't like this one. Okay. All right. There we go. Boop. Yeah, same. All right. Good luck, buddy. Likewise. You're on the play, no doubt. That I'm going to be. Hoping I do my best. Yeah, that's 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 going to be a keep. Uh, why don't you show your hand? Okay. Um, I think. We'll be looking, obviously. Yep. Um, That's illegal. Mm-hmm. No, che no cheating. No peeking. Um, while we're at there for this, I think this sort of swath is going to help. Um, I'm excited for this and this, especially being on the play. As am I for these, and then we'll see if that can get us something fun. I got to pitch his hand. Got the wrong lands. It's all right, though. We'll go to six. not going to cut so to keep your blessing on top all right exactly yeah that was that was done with all all love all right that's six i will keep oh yeah i will look away um yeah look away wide a second i'm gonna bottom here i'm not even sure what i bottom i think so i think this number right here is very relevant in this matchup so i'm actually This would be such a good seven, and it's like a okay, it's a okay six. All right, I'm gonna bottom this one. All right, take it away. Okay. Scalding Tarn, pass. I did reset life totals. Yes. Did, did give myself a game. Okay. I will draw. Okay. Didn't want to see that. That's the worst thing I could have possibly drawn. I'll play a windswept teeth and ship the turn. Mm, okay. Um, I'll crack. Getting a steam vents in tapped. The pretty one, obviously. Got you at 19. Beautiful. This is so nice. I do really like that. I got to, like, it's funny that the lands are the things that I'm least likely to cut from my cube, but it's the things I have the least, like, fancy versions of. Interesting. I just can't bring my, I don't know. It feels weird. Like, well, here's what, it, here's what it really is. Here's what it comes down to. I really want the Ravnica shock lands in foil and they are just obscenely expensive. Yeah. Just absolutely insane. Like four, five, six hundred dollars. You don't feel like spending six hundred dollars on a breeding pool? It's crazy. And so it's like to spend any money on the ones that I, that are not the ideal ones. Yeah. It just doesn't really do it for me. Anyway. And especially when inevitably a old border foil will be printed with a acceptable art. Well, I mean, I have three copies of them, right? So in my ideal world, I would have an OG foil, uh, a, well, whatever the cool fancy foil I like is, yeah. and then like another third kind. Right. But I would yeah. want to have different varieties of each if I could if I could manage it. I hear you. All right, Island Pass. I'm gonna go get a tap Sacred Foundry. Okay. Boop. Oh yeah. Yeah, I was talking with someone this weekend about how I actually find myself really gravitating towards the middle cycle of the shocks. Just that art is so good. Deep Root Wayfinder. Deep Root You mean like the Dissension ones, basically? Yeah. Uh, Deep Root Wayfinder's fine. Go ahead. End of turn. Thought Scour. Targeting me? Targeting me. Go ahead. Cut down. Rip. 
Steam vents. And draw that. That's cool. Untap. Yeah. Untap. Keep draw. I get about getting used to the mic now. It's kind of annoying. Uh, it's just a, an adjustment. Second island. Good horde. Sure. Pass the turn. Untap. Draw. I do not have to worry about two instants. I'll play Wooded Foothills. I'll go to combat. Mm -hmm. I'll attack you for two. It's if it deals damage to a player. To you. I get to surveil one and then put a land from my graveyard to the battlefield tapped. I'm going to block with Dreadhold. Okay. They bounce. Cool. Uh, then I am going to arc trail two and one. I'll force that. Pitching negate. Cool. Um, so what do you have? You have just Thought Scour in your graveyard to flashback right now? Thought Scour and Cut Down. Okay. I'm going to sacrifice this Wooded Foothills and shop in a Temple Garden. Okay. My removal. How many cards do you have in hand after that force? Three. I'm going to oust it. Second from the top? Yep. And you gain three. Back up to 22. Hell yeah. And mm -hmm. I'll pass the turn. You get to win. For a second. Okay. <laughs> my oust <gasps> more like ouch am i right <laughs> i thought so carefully too about my lines but all right it happens okay we got six tick six six merc tide and i will pass that is probably lights out i really i really hope so tarot's tracker cool Guys, cradle, trigger, or make a clue. Okay. Man. Absolutely mega punished. And guys, cradle. Pretty good with uh, clue tokens. Only two creatures out. Yeah, that's all right. I'll take it. Um, Play Arbor Elf. Could I have sequenced that differently? No, because I wanted to play Tower's Tracker before I played the land, so there's yeah. no way I could have possibly done all those yeah. things. All right, uh, and I will pass the turn. Tap. Draw the Arcanist. Got three other cards in hand. My man's got to stop drawing Murktide Region. That's extremely rude. I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> if it wasn't him, it would be Tassiger, which is obviously a lot less threatening against you. This is kind of a. Can't tell if this is desperate or not, but I think I just want to be mana. Try to be mana efficient. I'm gonna cycle Shark Typhoon mm -hmm. for no value. Mm -hmm. Draw. Man, not what you want to see either. Hit the land. Hit the land. Okay, <clears throat> I'm at twenty-two. Run that out. Go in four, six. I'm down to ten. Okay. Pass. Your boy is on a very fast clock. Yeah, but a 
Titania. Titania. And then you got nothing in the yard except for Shark Typhoon, right? Yep. Good combat. Cool. Attack with these two. Two cards in hand? Two cards in hand. Block the Wayfinder again? Okay. They'll bounce. I will sacrifice this clue. Mm -hmm. Tapping like that to draw a card. So okay. you'll take four. Cool. 18. I'll draw. And then clue is gone, but I will play a Den of the Bugbear. Get another clue. Okay. Seems good. Also going to tap the guy's cradle, put wild growth on my forest. Mm -hmm. and I've got two extra mana. I will use it to sacrifice the clue. Yep. Draw a card. Trigger. Trigger, but another counter here. Just a 5-4? Five, 5-4. Four. Five, four. And I will pass the turn. And tap. Cards in hand. Two. Okay. Now three. It's kind of annoying, but I really just got to do this. <clears throat> I think this is what I have to do. So I'm going to... Fork Bolt, targets being Wayfinder and Arbor Elf. Gonna respond. Okay. Tap to untap this. Mm -hmm. You're at 18 still? It's a really good card for you to have right now, is the thing. Mm -hmm. um, That's a very scary sight to see. Yeah, I think I got to do it. All right. Uh, I'm going to march the Dreadhorde Arcanist in response to the Fork Bolt. Oh, man. I mean, it's not great. I was very close to being able to just march the Burktide Reach if you let me untap. Yeah. So I don't love this. Okay. Uh, this still dies. And March is exile, so. Uh, exile. March is not exile, but that's exiled. Uh, yeah, I mean, yeah, 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 it exiles. Okay. Damn. Okay, so you're going to hit me for five, six, seven. Get a fetch. Double trigger for tracker. Eight, nine. It's close. <laughs> it's a tight one. All right. I'm not going to win by blocking, so I'm going to attack for six. Take you to four. I go to four. Okay. Done? Yeah. That is so spicy. I hate it. That is that. so spicy. You hate hearing it. Wow. That is the spiciest. Let's see if we get there. Oh, no. No. Thank God. No black no. mana. No, it's not no black oh, mana. Okay. That's not the problem. Oh, that's so disappointing. Wow, that's really sad. So now what's correct to do? This animates. It's just 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. You go to 8. So we just got a swing. I'll reveal the sad thing now. Okay. Which is that I don't have double red, so I can also activate Den and get right. Buku Winota triggers. Oh, no. Only one really busted card trigger. I mean, my deck is not an amazing Winota deck. Uh, yeah, so I think at this point I am just on – I either need to hit – Pia. I think I have to hit Pia and Karen Nalar is my only out. Okay. 
this brings a land into play tapped. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. So uh, we will go to combat. We will attack with both of these. We mm -hmm. get a Winota trigger. Okay. Two, three, four, five, six. It's seven cards? Six? It's six. That's so gross. Yeah, I mean, I hit knight tapped and attacking, but that's only one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So I got to animate that den, baby. So that's it. You got it. Let's go to game three. I, this whole time, I was just like choked on mana and delving, like having to thought scour away lands. I really... You can't have both a bunch of lands and a, a bunch of broken spells. If I was Theo, I could. <laughs> oh, man. Ultra punished for that Alst. Yeah. Because I... Yeah. I, so bad. It was like the perfect sequence of threats. Yeah. And then having that stupid fork bolt, too, also just kept me from being able to march your dragon. Yeah. Damn. I mean, I'm very grateful for it because it kept me in, but... So close. There was a world where I was like... That or unholy heat, which actually, if I did not do that, I would have. You would have probably won, right? Because you didn't do what? Uh, I I had unholy heat in my hand at the same time as fork bolt, so I could have gone for just the tracker, which was a consideration oh. in my head for a moment. But I was like, I need to get that would have been a okay. Yeah, you, you would have been fine. You can kill a tracker. I mean, it's not fine. I still I like my tracker. Yeah, yeah but, but I would have let you do it, and yeah. then I would have untapped and removed the dragon, and then it's still a close game. Now yeah. you have. Dreadheart Arcanist against my 2-3 and my 1-1. One, one. Yeah. Although I was about to draw Winota. Yeah. But then I'd also rebuy a bunch of removal, so it'd be... Yeah, it would have been different. Well, you've only had, you would have only had only heat in the graveyard at that point. You doubled everything else away. Well, I would have had the fork bolt still in my hand. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, that would have been a mess. A big old mess. You can go ahead. I'm going to cut you. I'm on the play. Cool. Let's reset the life totals. So far, every match has gone to game three, which is really... If you uh, could just not draw Murktide region again, that would be very chill. Okay. That's all I ask? I'm just have that be on the bottom of your deck? Is it so Is it so much to ask? Maybe. Maybe. All right, I'll show my hand first. I'll keep. And here's my hand. Chat. And then go ahead and show your hand. All right. I'm going to throw this back. While it is like technically functional, it's actually pretty not. Um, I don't see a world where that keeps me in this one. Be great to treasure cruise, but. Treasure Cruise after doing nothing is not going to be how I win this game. You never know. The card's broken. My blessing. Thank you. Thank you. I touch you with my thingy. I love the blessings of friendship. Okay. This, on the other hand, this we can work with. I'm going to show it real quick, Andy. I'm not taking. Um, you have no good card ideas. He's, he's right. These are all bad cards. Um... This one is going to go on the bottom, as much as I'd like it here. Um, I like these more. We'll see how it goes. Okay. Ready? I'm ready. Woody footy. Oh, yeah. Pass. Wooded footsies. I don't like that. Mountain. Pass. Sacrifice wooded foothills for A. My thing in the right window again. Temple Garden. Tap Stomping Ground. Stomping Ground. If it looks like a run in six, and it smells like a run in six. My deck is mostly green red. Yeah. The white is a splash, and there's one black card, two black cards, so. Yeah. That's the default land again. I just wanted to see if there's any reason to not get the default. Yeah. I'll the, untap. The vanishing verse is uh, nerve wracking. I will draw. There. Play a forest. Mm -hmm. Cast Ren and six. 
Force of Will. Exiling. Treasure Cruise. I think I forgot to take your life off last time for Force of Will, but it didn't matter. He didn't go to one, so. Um, all right. Cool. Pass turn. Draw. Island, perfect mana. Sprite Dragon for one. I'm at 18. Okay. Untap. Draw. Tap to Temple Garden and <coughs> say go. Okay. Tap. Draw. It's a magic card. This is a this is a pretty sad start. Um, swing in with Sprite Dragon for one. I mean, you counter my Brennan six. I don't know what else you can complain about. I'm not complaining. Yeah. Pass. Cards in hand. Three. Planes. Utopia sprawl on the forest, naming black. Oh, ominous. Thalia and the Gitrog monster. Because it's an addition to. Okay, okay. First strike two. Ooh, and death touch. And then pass the turn. May I read that? It's. A lot yeah, of I words. can play additional land each of my turns. First strike, death touch, and when I attacks, I sacrifice a creature or land. I must, not a may, mm -hmm. and I draw a card. And creatures and non basic lands and non basic lands you control come into play tap. Neat. This feels like I'm in danger, but that's a pretty decent. Uh -huh. suit. I'm in danger. I feel very in danger. <laughs> um, I'm gonna play Fetid Pools tapped. Mm -hmm. Um, I think it's just time to be a bit more aggressive. Um, You've been attacking every turn. Yeah. Fork bolt two to you. That's very aggressive. All right. Well, it's very much like the unholy heat, my own. Uh... <laughs> that was very strange. I don't know what you were thinking. <laughs> uh, it worked. <laughs> uh, trigger. I was like, make him have it. He didn't have it, but it was uh, reckless, to say the least. Take two. Yeah. Pass the turn. Trade four for four. Oh, his first strike. That's so gross. Go to combat. Cool. Oh, actually, no, because I can tap lands first. I've been sacrificed tapped lands. Yep. Uh, that's what I'm going to do instead. Mm -hmm. So I guess I should play a Windswept Heath. I'm going to fetch in Shock. Yeah, do it. Go to 10. Definitely do it. I'll get a Sacred Foundry. Okay. actually very frustrating the way this is sequenced i guess i can tap these but that doesn't actually oh well Renata. p and kieran nalar that's really unfortunate two thoppies yeah top top baby oh man this is and i will go to combat Attack with Thalia and the Gitrog monster. Sacrifice a planes and draw shuffle card. real quick. Draw a card. Untapped land one time. Zero times? Come in for four. Take four. Got you at 15. 15. And I will pass the turn. Man, this is not how you want to see it go. That's a lot of mana. Tapped Sigur. <laughs> Tap Sigur is tapped. This is dying next turn either way, so I might as well just make you double block. Two two with sprite. I uh, yeah, I'm thinking. Yeah. How many cards in hand? One. I'll take two. Cool. Go to eight. Okay. Anything else? That's it. I will untap. You can see the lights fading right now. I will draw. Play a wooded foothills.
keeping one mana short of doing all the coolest stuff. I mean, this feels pretty good right now from your side of the street. No, I think I'm doing all right, but I could be doing cooler stuff. Yeah, I mean, looks pretty cool from this side of the board. So if I want to... I definitely regret that land I put the Utopia Sprawl on, which is weird how much it matters, but it really has mattered the past couple turns. Hmm. Um... I think I have to do that, which means that I only have three mana to work with. One card in hand. I'm sorry to keep re reaffirming. You're fine. You're good. It's right here. All right. Go to combat. Yeah. Attack with everybody. I'm taking eight. Uh, trigger in response to Thalia and the oh man I just I is it I whenever should. a land enters the graveyard you draw a card no no it's just okay when, just, I, I just I can just when you sacrifice yeah. it okay um yeah I guess it's really not a good way to sequence this huh good I mean it's fine I'm just gonna sacrifice the uncracked wooded foothills yeah uh and I will sounds. draw a card and you've got this many coming at you. you take an eight. I'm down a seven. Then let's pay five and stomp the Ooh. sprite dragon. Brutal. And vanishing verse tossiger. That's going to be game. Like almost definitely. I hope so. And then I'll pass the turn. Yeah, I didn't really draw much at all this game. And that's not going to be enough. So, yeah, that's game. Whew. GG's, man. GG's. All these games have been close. Yeah. Which, I, which I'm happy about as a cube designer. They've yeah. been very close games. As a player, I wish they were all very not close and I was crushing everybody. Yeah. But, you know, I have to settle for close games. I mean, hey, at least one, one game this match was definitely that. That um, Oof. that has indestructible against me. I have no way to remove that. All my yeah, I know. Stuff. I looked at your deck list. <laughs> yeah, I'm just like, oh great, cool. I see how this is gonna go. Well, I si that's not true. I sideboarded in, go for the throat, which I bottomed in my mulligan, mm -hmm. and then didn't draw any black mana the whole game until the fetid pools. And it was yeah. Just... This is the matchup where I think I'm supposed to sideboard into a kind of clunky deck with a lot of four drops, just because big creatures. I can't, I can't deal with it. You have a hard time answering big creatures, which is like the opposite of how I'm gonna have to sideboard against. Uh, Evan, who can answer a lot of big creatures, but his removal is all premium, so I'm just going to be playing like small ball and yeah. trying to be more mana efficient. Yeah, I brought in Austin Magmatic Single yeah. to try My, and answer your big creatures. I'm just trying to deal with Ren and Six where I can, or a creature with the versatility here, and then take care of what I can. Very nice. Good game.